my name is uh, I'm David Irwin. So I'm currently uh, an associate professor and head of the Department of Mathematics and Applied Mathematics. Um, so I do mathematics, and I, I say that specifically um, because the department actually has uh, two different kinds of mathematicians in. One of the one of the the big things that happens when you go from high school to university level mathematics is you discover that the mathematics is a lot broader than it might otherwise appear to be. And um, specifically, um, mathematics at university level has, has two, you know, this is a simplification, but, but two big um, sub areas, one of which is pure mathematics, the other is applied mathematics. And so I'm a, I'm a pure mathematician. And what that means is, I mean, it's a little bit of a simplification, but it, 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 it's, it's loosely speaking the case that, that pure mathematics is mathematics for its own sake. Um, and that means that, that, that pure mathematics a lot of the time consists of theorems and proofs, um, which unfortunately have largely um, 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 found their way out of this, the high school syllabus, um, uh, from what I've been told. Um, applied mathematics, on the other hand, is when people take mathematics and they apply it to real world problems. And so things like that are examples of you know, theoretical physics, for example, is, is, is frequently referred to as applied mathematics. Um, using mathematics to model the, the spread of uh, viruses like COVID-19, you know, math mathematical modeling, um, that's applied mathematics. So there are two different kinds of, of people in the department, loosely speaking, pure mathematicians and applied mathematicians. And when you come to the department and you, you start doing mathematics here, uh, after high school, you know, you can actually do majors in both pure mathematics and applied mathematics as well.